hydrological cycle. Rain is the first form of water and is the primary source. The average annual rainfall of India is 1200 mm. Only 35% runoff is utilized and balance simply goes waste by flowing into the sea. For instance, when it rains in a city, while considering minimum rainfall of 25 mm per day and let us assume a medium individual house of 100 square meter of roof area yields around 2000 liters of water and 10 houses 20,000 liters. Supposing a residential urban block consisting of 500 houses with a rooftop area of around 100 square meters, each such block would yield 1 million liters of water in a day and it is regretted that it flows as waste into the drain. Let us think over what happens in the area of such a numerous blocks in the city. The colossal quantity of precious rainwater is wasted since it flows into the drains and it overflows. This will cause havoc like destroying and damaging roads, clogging street drains, besides causing detrimental effects to human life and property. This very water required for human consumption would have to be pumped back, filtered and transported through expensive pipelines and water tankers. The only solution to overcome this problem is by adopting rainwater harvesting methods. Now altered in the invention of a completely revolutionary type dual intensity rainwater harvesting filters based on the working principle of cohesion and centrifugal force. The downtake pipes from the roof has to be interconnected and lead till the filter unit and has to be connected to the inlet of the rainy filter. The rainwater along with dirt and debris flows by gravity through the pipeline, enters into the filter, starts rotating in anti-clockwise direction at the periphery of the upper housing so as to flow into the SS304 filter element placed in the lower housing in angular motion at specific velocity which creates cohesive force at low intensity and centrifugal force during high intensity of rainfall which aids the filter element to flush out automatically the dirt and debris through the drain outlet and simultaneously divert clean water into the sump or recharging well through the clean water outlet. By storing of water in the sump and reutilizing, 